Well, it is always a treat to have the owner of Builder Source Appliance Gallery in our Builder Source kitchen and escorted by the lovely Jane Butel, one of the first <laughs> chefs to ever make an appearance <laughs> on New Mexico style. So happy to have you back at holiday time. Well, we you love you much. all. Well, we're wrapping <laughs> up a year and going into a brand new one, and who better to have here to celebrate it than the two of you? Thank you. So much to do, and of course, you know, <coughs> as we wind down from Hanukkah and Christmas and we go into New Year's, a lot of people want to know, what can I make at home? You know, a lot of people are just not sure what what to make for their families food-wise, and you always have great ideas. Well, aren't you nice? It's I love true, you too. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought of uh, a green chili crusted quiche. Oh. Mm. And green chilies, you know, we all love them here in of New Mexico. Course. And instead of pie crust, which takes a lot of time and has lots of calories and uh -huh. fat grams and all that stuff, all you do is just generously butter, and I used uh, a New Mexican pottery uh, oh. uh, pie plate, but you could use glass or metal. And, oh, that's the uh, plate! Yeah, this is a pie plate. I that was the <laughs> crust! <laughs> and this is the crust. I've taken green Amazing. chilies, and these green chilies, I, I just, um, I got them ready ahead of time. That's and and I parched them, froze them, peeled them, I mean, I had them in the freezer and peeled them. Yeah. And then just laid them out flat, you put the point in the middle, mm -hmm. okay. and then you make this really fun, easy quiche. And I love this idea. you can substitute well, you can just substitute. You can leave the uh, chorizo out. Oh, yes. Chorizo is um, so yummy. You probably can't see this. <laughs> um, but all, all I'm doing is I um, sauteed this uh, ahead of time, and I'm okay. just, and I uh, drained it really well. Well, you get your protein, you get your mm -hmm. green chili. <laughs> you get well, this is really healthy, and <laughs> yeah. it's not quite minus calories, but it's, uh, <laughs> it's pretty low calories. So we're going to take four eggs, okay. and this will serve eight people, oh, wow. well, six to eight, That's and it great. has no salt, because you get enough salt from the chorizo and the cheese. Good point, good point. And we're just adding whole milk. Mm -hmm. And you really don't have to go to a lot of trouble on this one. In fact, I serve this frequently. Ooh, Do getting you? a little carried away <laughs> uh, for Sunday brunches or something like oh, that. That's a good idea. And you can get the green chili uh, crust ready, and then you just pour this over it. So it, you make it look wow. so easy. It is easy. <laughs> the hardest part is peeling all those chilies. I was just going to say, you, you make that look easy, too. That part I've tried myself thanks to your <laughs> teachings, and I, I did not do it as well as you did. Oh, well, you, I've had a lot of years. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we're not going there. Uh, <laughs> and this is the cheddar and jack cheese grated, and it's one cup. Perfect. And Onions, you yum. can see how quickly. And then this wow. is just a little garnish. You could leave out the tree, so you can use different kinds of cheeses. Oh, okay. I'd recommend a, a cheese, but you can use the low-fat ones. Could you use, like, a mozzarella? You could. In fact, Monterey Jack, you know, is 60% mozzarella. Right. You t you taught me that, too. Yeah. I didn't know and that. And speaking of yeah. teaching, you know, what's so it's great a is... It's a cheddar mozzarella yeah. blend. Oh, Isn't okay. that interesting? Yeah. yeah. I mean, she teaches so much, and in fact, very uh, nice thing is that she actually teaches students as well, because you're teaching classes over at Builder oh, Source. Oh, I do. Gallery, I do. Right? I teach them at Builder Source. In fact, we're almost we, we're starting to get them to where we have to turn people away. They're so really full. Oh. yeah. Well, how and this can is just a tablespoon of my own brand of chili. We ship all over the world. That's right. You said people are ordering from all over. Yeah, we just shipped to Belgium and Paris. Um, how do they do what now? How do they how do they get involved with the classes? What do they need to do? Um, well, just uh, 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 on my website, janebetelcooking.com. Uh -huh. Yeah. Just sign up. That's it. Or uh, and enough. Builder Source has their own website. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you can go to Builder Source Appliance Gallery. I, um, <laughs> but it's just buildersource.com, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. Builder and we'll have those com. details at cost.com. And through the magic well. of television, I want to show you what it looks like when it's finished. Okay, okay. I want to see. I want to see. <laughs> <laughs> now, I, I see there's like some chili yeah, that being made over good. here as well, hence the apron because I didn't want it to bubble on my white shirt. Because yeah. I, I, I'm, a, I'm a little bit of a mess in the kitchen. <laughs> Did you, you know. notice all the different colors on the green it's chili? It's beautiful. It's Looked beautiful. Like you, something you could hang up on the wall. It, it's like a painting, ah, Jean. Yeah. Thank she's you. A, she's well, this is one amazing. that I have previously made. I just made it. Oh. And um, oh, I love the magic up. of TV. I just love it. <laughs> 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 and now we're going to, s I love to serve this on the red chili. Yeah, I did this, uh, oh, quite a while ago, actually, on the um, Food Network. Oh, nice. And uh, we got a lot of 
calls. So you put down the uh, red This chili is just first. a basic red chili sauce. And okay. these recipes, this recipe is on my website, jamebutel, www.jamebutelcooking.com. And, while, and you're, while you're serving that, Jane, I just want to mention that one of the things I think people get very concerned about when they're making a dish like this is just making a mess and having to clean the dishes because the cooking part, the eating part, all great. But cleaning up afterwards, not so great. And Mike actually has a little solution for us today, don't you? I do. <laughs> what is it? Tell us, please. <laughs> this is a new dishwashing uh, detergent that we have at the store. Okay. And it's made by Excelsior. It's mm -hmm. a Canadian company. Oh, okay. But it's uh, totally biodegradable. Nice. It's 100% chlorine free and phosphate free, safe for septic systems, and eliminates the white film that you get on glasses and on your dishes that you're experiencing That's in your dishwasher great. now. And so, but what's nice of this, you use just one tablespoon of it. Okay. You'll get 66 loads out of one bottle like oh my this, gosh. that's 38 cents a load, but it also leaves your dishwasher sparkling clean. Wow. Does an outstanding job. So, environmentally, products don't normally work really easy. <laughs> right, right. This one works excellent. We've oh, used that's it fantastic. now for about six weeks and it does a great job. And we can buy that at Builder Source? Mm -hmm. Oh, perfect. Then we also have the What's same thing for your. Uh, uh, washers. So that if you don't wear an apron and you make a mess, which I do every day. In, oops, so you <laughs> Sorry. can throw them in the washer. Oh great. Everything is the same on this. It's biodegradable. Nice. 100% uh, chlorine free and phosphate free and it's good for septic systems. Perfect. But the biggest thing is it eliminates the need for detergents, uh, softeners, bleaches, so OxyClean, any ad all you need. You fill up that little cup in the front uh -huh. about halfway for a full size load. Okay. And that's all you need. I love this. You don't this. even need dryer sheets. Oh my God, that's perfect. It's all in one, so you don't have to say, "I oh, forgot to add the fabric, the fabric softener right. thing." And the nice <laughs> thing too is, you, on new front-loading washers, you've heard some some of the um, uh, information on on some mildew or some molding mm -hmm. buildup in washers. Yeah. That's usually caused because a lot of detergents that are out now have animal fat in it. Okay. And so that dries, and that's what causes. This has no animal fat. It's purely enzyme. That's amazing. Cleaner. Thank you and for so this. It works so excellent. builder source you can get that. And of course, Jane, I have to taste the food. Oh, I thank you both beautiful. so much for sharing. This, this is, is a wonderful way huge. to end the year. I gotta get my fork ready. Oh, I've got them. <laughs> fun, fun, fun. Thank you all so wow. much for joining us. Alright, I'm taking a bite. And of course, we highly recommend that you just go to our <laughs> website at Casa.com for more details on this amazing dish and all the good stuff at Builder Source Appliance Gallery. And we all want to say Happy New Year. Happy and New come Year. Come cook with Happy us. New Year. <laughs> wow, this is awesome. Happy New Year. Oh, thank you, Mike. Oh, this is good. Mm. Yeah, I'm not you. shocked.